Hey guys, this is Taran speaking and welcome back to my channel. If your sims need a place to celebrate Halloween, this haunted nightclub would be the perfect place for a party. Long time ago, this used to be a huge mansion. It was renovated earlier this year and will reopen just in time for Halloween. This building is known to be a very haunted place. The urban legend says that there used to be a wealthy family living here. A father, a mother and three daughters in the early 1830s. The legend says that the youngest daughter got a mysteriously disease. She started to act strangely and say peculiar things. The doctor could not find any cure for this. Her father was a very firm and strict businessman and he was worried about what the rest of the town would say if they knew about this so he decided to keep her home and locked inside the upper tower where no one but him was allowed to visit. One day the older twins went up to the tower without permission. The father who was in his study and the mother outside in the garden suddenly heard the twins' terrified screams. They ran into the direction of the screams when it suddenly became quiet. They ran towards the tower, which door were open, and the sight that met them inside was horrible. Fresh, warm blood everywhere. Floors, walls, and all the furniture were soaked in blood, but the children were nowhere to be found. The parents and the staff searched the mansion and the ground area around the house for days, but without any trace of the children. The other villagers soon started to believe that the father had killed them and buried them in the mountains. But there were no proof of such things since there were no bodies, he was not convicted. The rest of the town started to fear and avoid this man. So one night, he left to visit his wife without any of his belongings. The staff who lived there were keeping the mansion in a very good state, but soon after the parents left, strange things started to happen. They said they could hear children's laughter and cries from the rooms where the children once slept, and that they often heard footsteps and doors that was opening themselves. Someone even claimed that they had seen three children in the upper tower. The staff was terrified and left as well, and soon the mansion started to fall. He says that the mansion was sold several times over the years but no family who lived there stayed more than a few weeks before they left, all claiming that this place was haunted. In time, the mansion was left alone and soon forgotten. One day, 180 years later, a wealthy investor came to the area and bought the mansion. No one really knows anything about him or where he got his fortune from, but he decided to renovate the place and open up a nightclub here. The ground floor have a huge reception area where a grand and magnificent hall once greeted any visitors. And there would be a huge bar area and a dance floor in the main living room. It kept the lounge as it was where people could sit and talk. Many of the furniture were well preserved so he kept a lot of them as well as all the pictures. Any visitors can see pictures of the proud man once living here and the fair mother holding and playing with her children. One day during the renovating, the investor was aside what soon would turn out to be a parking lot. He was looking at the building when suddenly he saw three small shades in the upper tower. He started to walk up to get closer with hasty steps and wanted to see for themselves where the three children had disappeared. But the stairs were in very bad shape and almost impossible to walk upon. And when he entered the tower, the children were long gone. There were nothing but old and worn out furniture who almost were torn apart, scratches on a door where he could believe that the youngest daughter had tried to get out of this miserable room. He decided then to give the tower some new furniture and remove the stairs and door so no one could disturb the three children while they were visiting the nightclub. This bill can be downloaded from the Sims 4 gallery and there is a link in the description below. If you like my build and video, hit the follow and subscribe on YouTube and Twitter. I hope you have a lot of fun with this build. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.